Google reviews are not showing up. Understanding missing and delayed reviews. Lately, many Google business profile owners started complaining that their Google reviews are not being shown or not being published or being removed. FYI, Google business profile is former Google My Business. This issue creates serious difficulties in local ranking, which is vital for many businesses. Let's find out why it happens and what you can do. Why my Google reviews are not showing up. In short, Google reviews might be missing because of two reasons. One, reviews might be delayed. Two, reviews might be filtered. What is the specific reason why my Google reviews are not showing up? Google will almost never provide you a specific reason when filtering reviews. We, Google, reserve the right to disable user-generated contributions for individual business profiles and business categories to prevent abuse. We also reserve the right to remove content that violates our policies or terms of service and to suspend or delete abusive accounts. The decisions about filtering Google reviews are made by robots, not humans. Google started using automated spam detection measures to remove reviews that are probably spam. Google confirms that because of that, legitimate reviews are sometimes inappropriately removed. Although, Google considers that these spam prevention measures help improve people's experiences on Google. It means that decisions about filtering reviews are made by the Google algorithm, and sometimes quality reviews will be filtered as well. Why my Google reviews might be delayed? Usually, when users post a review, they can almost instantly see their reviews as published on their devices, although these reviews may still not be viewed by the public. Some reviews get published within 2 to 3 hours, however, others may take 2 to 7 business days. I would suggest contacting Google support after 7 days the review was posted, and getting ready to provide the screenshot of the review left by the user, if available. Please take into consideration. 1. Users on older mobile devices and operating systems might have issues leaving reviews. To fix the problem, users should update their operating system and Google Maps app version. 2. If you set a future opening date for your business that hasn't opened yet, any reviews left before it's open to the public will be removed. Why my reviews might be filtered by Google? Your review might be filtered for many reasons which are presented in three different documents. 1. Your review might be filtered if it does not follow Maps user contributed content policy. 2. Your review might be filtered if it consists of prohibited and restricted content. 3. Your review might be filtered if it does not follow the guidelines for representing business on Google. You can find the links to these documents in comments below this video. Besides following Google policies, Google review has a high risk to be filtered. If a review is too long, more than 1,000 characters, and a review does not look genuine or looks like an advertisement. If a review contains URLs, phone numbers, or addresses. If a review contains prohibited and restricted content, spam and fake content, off-topic content, restricted content, illegal content, terrorist content, sexually explicit content, offensive content, dangerous and derogatory content, impersonation, and conflict of interest. If a review were left by the employer or left by a current or former employee. If a review is not based on real experiences and information. If the reviews were requested from customers in bulk, F. For example, the email campaigns. If a review comes from the same physical location, from the same IP address. For example, if a reviewer shares an IP address with someone who already left you a review, the review might be flagged. Another example, if your business offers Wi-Fi that customers connect to and you've logged into your Google business profile account. If the reviewer is located far away from the business location or has never physically visited the business location. If the reviewer left the same exact review elsewhere on the internet, for example, Facebook, Yelp, Bing, or the content for the review was taken from another business. If the number of reviews is abnormally higher than most businesses in your industry. If other Google users, other than the reviewer or business owner, report the review as offensive, spam, not relevant, or inappropriate, and anything else. That might trigger Google's robots to filter the review. God only knows. Because Google never discloses the real reasons for filtering the reviews. Remember that Google will almost never provide you a specific reason when filtering harmless or apparently harmless reviews. What can you do to show filtered Google reviews? If your review was filtered, you can appeal to Google Business Profile Support. 
Make sure to take screenshots of the reviews if available and pass that information to Google support team. There is no guarantee that the reviews will show, but there is a chance of success if you can strongly support your point of view. Probably, the most important conclusion. If you were no able to reinstate filtered reviews, do not stop asking your clients to review your business on Google and try to follow the tips from this article to reduce the chance of being filtered. Why the fake one-star reviews are not filtered by Google? Great question. It is amazing that Google is trying to improve its reviews filtering algorithm. The policy says, Google review policy prohibits spam and fake content. Google requires reviews to reflect a person's genuine experience at a location or business. I just wonder why this new algorithm is not applying to the fake one-star reviews which almost all businesses have. It happens when an unknown user who never was at the location of the business creates a Google account just to leave one harmful review for your business without providing any details. Why do these annoying reviews not qualify for filtering? So far, I was not able to receive or find any answers. Share with us your thoughts. And do not hesitate to contact Dimico Web if you need any type of assistance with your digital presence. We are only one click away to help you become number one online.